what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how uh, to fix this issue if you have problems with city skylines not launching or not starting properly so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix this issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work here on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really be thankful for that And I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So as the first step I want you to uh, basically open up your task manager by using the shortcut or going down to your taskbar right clicking it and opening up your task manager what I want you to do next is gonna to be to uh, navigate to the top left corner of your screen just to ensure that you're sticking around processes and clicking one of those processes. Afterwards, you need to type in C to search for city skylines. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, I want you to simply right click and end the task. So once you did that, you should be able to end the task manager again. As the next step, I want you to take Steam or wherever you downloaded it for me, it's Steam, your shortcut on your desktop or uh, your game shortcut um, doesn't really matter and if you don't have it on your desktop I want you to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen clicking onto the Windows symbol using your Windows search function in order to find it and once you found it I want you to drag it right onto your desktop once it is on your desktop let's quickly come back right click on that navigate down to properties once the steam properties pop up I want you to click on top compatibility and uh, simply copy my settings. So compatibility mode, enable run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8. So select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as uh, enable run this program as an administrator. Once you're finished, I want you to click apply and OK. I would personally recommend you to restart your PC afterwards. And once you restarted it, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right onto your shortcut. What I want you to do next is simply double click it and launch it and launch it over the launcher. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And I'm sorry, guys, if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.